what's up fam how are you doing welcome to my youtube channel if it's your first time here thank you so much for coming if it's your second time or third time or you're always a member of this family just know that i really do appreciate you yes i really really do appreciate you on today's video i want to talk to you guys about importance of journaling like benefits of journaling last week i spoke about how to start journaling and by the way if you didn't watch that video kindly click on that link popping right there you can go watch it and then you can finish this after or maybe finish this one first then go watch it after that i'm hoping at the end of this video someone will be able to just see the importance of doing it like why they need to do it yes so great people i have my youtube book right here with me yes and i'm gonna share with you all these points i only have six points so i hope this video is not gonna be too long but again they are very very important points so please just bear with me and just listen to these points why you need to start journaling and before i get to the points in case you didn't watch last week's video and you just happened to be here journaling according to my definition is that it's a continuous practice of putting down your thoughts on paper and the first reason why you need to actually do it is because it reduces stress yes journaling is a stress management tool if you didn't know by the way so the more you put down your thoughts on paper the more you're letting go of so many things like it's like you know that feeling when you want to tell someone something and there's just so much inside you like your heart is just full of so many things and you just want to go and meet someone and then tell them that feeling that you usually have after telling them is what you will feel after journaling down your thoughts on paper so it's the same thing like it's just that now the person that you'll be talking to is that book that book is going to be your therapist by the way yes so so it's very very important for us to journal and it will it is a way of releasing stress and even i even spoke about it on my video of depression is real if you didn't watch that one as well kindly click on that link popping go watch it maybe after this video yes i did that video after going through so much and one of the ways that i was able to overcome whatever i was going through was through writing like journaling down it did work for me then it's still it's still working for me now and if you're stressed out there please start journaling you will thank me later for sure for sure you will the second reason why it's very important to start journaling is because through journaling you'll be able to allow yourself to self-reflect and what i mean by this is um the moment you take your pen and paper you'll be focusing on yourself i know the older we get the more responsibility we have and sometimes there's nothing you can do about it for example um you have children they they all depend on you you have a husband maybe you have your mother that you're taking care of or maybe your father you have your parents out there that you're taking care of you have all these things that are happening in your life there are just so many people that you need to attend to sometimes you don't find time for yourself so through journaling the moment you take your pen and paper and then you just sit down like this you'll be thinking about yourself like where is christine at how am i feeling like am i in good space am i you know that time it's very very important the time that you take even if it's just 10 minutes a day even if it's just five minutes a day just to take time and reflect on yourself and just you know it's very important trust me like when you're in peace with your mind everyone around you is going to feel it but when you're disturbed up here everyone around you is going to be affected as well so journal 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 you need to start journaling in case you've not started yet the third benefit of journaling is it improves your mood yes like for example when you have so many things stressing you and then you just take down your pen and paper and then you start writing it's like you're pouring out your feelings you're just letting go everything on that paper like you just you know and this happened to me last week i think um there's a video that will be coming very soon where i felt so frustrated i was editing this video and I exported it and then for some reason it didn't because I was trying to export it straight from my machine to hard drive and there's usually just something when you're doing that. If you're watching this in your content creator and you want to export a video, please just try and export it to your machine straight. Don't put it on the hard drive direct. Like it was just so frustrating. I just felt so frustrated that day and then after that I just decided to shut down my, my laptop and then I was leaving the office but before leaving the office I usually journal. So when I went down there to journal, like after writing everything I just felt better yeah as in there's just something like you know like you just feel better after doing it so it just changes your mood completely i was at a hundred very very mad and then a few minutes later after journaling down i was good again like i was like you know what 
things happen but we move i mean like we don't have to feel frustrated and just make the rest of my day become bad because of just one bad thing so i decided my mood just changed and i was happy again so journaling improves your mood by the way so if you feel something is really really disturbing your mind or maybe something just write it down like express it on paper the fourth point why i feel journaling is important is because it moves you closer to achieving your goals the moment you put it down on paper it's like you're making a note with yourself you're committing to something and this is something that I've done before and I keep doing it and even remember there's a book I came across one of my journals when I was back in high school I had a book and I used to write my goals like I used to write so many things back then I wasn't I don't know I was very very stubborn when I was back in high school but for some reason I always knew what I wanted so there was a book where I used to write whatever I wanted to become in life and I wanted to be like Catherine Casavulli for those who know Catherine Casavulli Catherine Casavulli used to be an old television presenter back in the days and i wanted to be like her and then i wanted to dance in a national dance competition which i did i was in sakata by there for those who didn't know so anyway <laughs> yeah and we got to the finals where the girls crew that got to the finals like we were the only girls crew that got to the finals in sakata yes and I did almost everything on that list. Like I did 29 of those. There were 30 things. I did 29. There's only one goal on that list of mine that I didn't do. I was supposed to be married by the time I was 25. Imagine when I was back in high school. I thought I would be married by 25. I mean, like this chick had goals, but I don't know what happened to that. But sometimes I look back and I'm like, hmm, that's the only goal on that list of mine that involved that involved someone else. Like. I needed a man for me to be married you know and that's the goal that i didn't achieve <laughs> anyway so back to the point like journaling moves you towards achieving your goals yes so just put it down on paper you'll be able to look at it and then you'll be like i'm the one who wrote it i'm supposed to do this so yeah you'll find yourself doing it by the way the fifth point why we all need to journal is because it helps us so much by improving our communication skills the more you write the more you become good at expressing yourself and just communicating your feelings if you have a relationship with someone you'll be able to know how to express yourself and just communicate how you feel with to that particular person when you're journaling you get to pour down your feelings like you're writing your feelings down on papers even when it comes to handling people around you'll be able to know how to talk to them like you'll be able to say what you're feeling without filtering things you get like you'll be able to just express yourself better so i think journaling is very very important especially if you want your relationship to flourish look at me giving relationship advice and one of my goals was to get married when i was 25 and i'm still here <laughs> anyway yeah you get my point our sixth point which is the last point is journaling boost your memory you, of course yes your brain tends to keep things that you've written down like most of the stuff that you've written down your memory your brain tends to keep them for example when you're in school whether you're in primary school whether you're in high school university you find that most of the time when the lecturers come you'll be taking your pen and paper and writing down notes it's because when you put it down on paper there's just something that it does you're able to even think about it like remember it and sometimes you find that even after putting down those notes from teacher you'll find someone taking those notes and making short notes that was me when i was back in high school like just writing it once was not going to help it stick here so i had to rewrite it again like take the notes and then write my own short notes from that and maybe you're watching this and you're that kind of person like maybe you find yourself doing that if you are let me know in the comment section but yeah journaling boost your memory and yeah the more you write the more you become good at it and you'll be able to even remember what you've written down that's our last point by the way if you've gotten here and you haven't subscribed to my channel i don't know what you're waiting for please subscribe to my channel join this amazing family i am a hundred percent sure you won't regret at all so thank you so much for watching if there's any other importance of journaling that i've left behind and you know please don't hesitate to leave a comment down below let the conversation continue and if you've gotten here and you like this particular video thumbs up again if you've gotten here and you haven't subscribed kindly press on that amazing lady and until next time good people kisses to you